Chapter 144 Matthew's face was pale and his body trembled slightly, as though he was really in fear. Alex frowned before he asked in a faint manner, did the jade plug crack? Mr. Anderson, you really are a master. I can't believe that you've actually guessed it right. Matthew's voice was very soft as he sighed, initially, we followed all of your instructions without fail. After sealing the jade plug off in the yellow bag, our entire family ate vegetarian food for seven days without seeing any blood at all. However, one day, my stupid nephew Watson secretly ate some stewed non-veg soup. Moreover, he accidentally stained chicken blood on the yellow paper bag that the jade plug was sealed in. As soon as the blood fell on the yellow paper bag, the jade plug cracked immediately. I've already beat Watson up and locked him up at home but strange things are still happening. Alex frowned before he asked, what kind of strange things have you encountered? Matthew hurriedly replied, last night, there was a violent thunderstorm. Unexpectedly, lightning actually struck and scorched the century-old tree in the Lane family courtyard. Besides that, the tablet of the Lane family's ancestors, which was enshrined in our ancestral hall, actually fell to the ground and broke into half for no reason at all. This is a terrible omen. Alex frowned as soon as he heard Matthew's words. From the perspective of Korean means, planting an osmanthus tree in the courtyard was a symbol of wealth and good fortune. However, since the osmanthus tree was scorched because it was struck by lightning, this indicated that misfortune was about to fall upon the Lane family. Moreover, a broken ancestor tablet signified that a member of the Lane family will die. Alex really did not expect the spirit contained in the jade plug to be so evil and ominous. Moreover, he did not expect it to be so powerful just because of a drop of chicken blood. When Matthew did not get a reply from Alex, he could feel his heart beating frantically. He continued pleading over the other end of the line, even though the Lane family has been involved in the business industry for many generations, I've always been kind towards others. I've never done anything to harm nature or hurt anyone at all. Mr. Anderson, please help me save my family. At this time, Alex could only reply, Mr. Lane. I would really like to save you but it seems as though the spirit in the jade plug is really very powerful. Since Watson has been carrying the jade plug on him for so many years, it seems as though it has already bound itself to the Lane family. Therefore, there is no way that we can deal with it by just using a simple talisman. What should I do now, then? The Lane family is suffering from so much misfortune. This is really unfortunate for the entire family. Matthew sighed as his voice trembled. Alex replied at this time, the evil spirit gains strength when it gets blood. Now that it has made contact with chicken blood, I am afraid that the only way we'll be able to subdue this spirit is by borrowing the power from the heavens. All right then, Mr. Anderson. I will definitely get you anything you need even if it means losing my entire fortune. At this time, Alex replied, well, it so happens that I will be participating in an auction held at the Money House tomorrow. I will check out the auction and see if there are any spiritual relics we'd be able to use to help you and your family. As for whether we will be able to win the bid for the items, that will really depend on your luck. Alright. I'm really sorry to have caused you so much trouble, Mr. Anderson, Matthew could not stop thanking Alex. After that, he quickly continued, Mr. Anderson, I will come over to drop off my gold card tomorrow. You can just use the gold card to purchase anything you need. Alex snorted. Since he was doing the Lane family a favor, he should obviously not have to spend his own money. At this time, Alex simply replied, Mr. Lane, you should be mentally prepared. It is not so easy to obtain any spiritual relics and sometimes, we will not be able to purchase it even if it is available. Therefore, whether we will be able to purchase the spiritual relics at the auction tomorrow or otherwise would really depend on your luck. Matthew answered, yes, I will also look for the spiritual relics on my own. However, I'm afraid I'd still have to trouble you, Mr. Anderson. After the incident at Old Street, 
Matthew had already sought out a number of well-known spiritual masters to get rid of the evil spirit. However, they would simply take one look at the Lane family mansion before waving their hands and leaving in a hurry because they did not even dare enter the mansion. Therefore, Matthew's only hope was Alex. In fact, Alex did not understand why this was happening. Matthew should have a peaceful and happy life because he had never done anything to harm anyone else in this life. Unexpectedly, in a twist of fate, his nephew, Watson turned out to be someone who would turn his entire family upside down. If Alex had not saved him the other day, the entire Lane family would have been destroyed within a year. Moreover, Matthew and Watson would not be the only ones gone from the face of this earth. His beautiful and hot Daisy would be dead too.